All right, it's been a little while since I've uh, played, but here we go. What we're going to be doing today is playing a nine-point match against Ian, and we're actually both going to do commentary separately, so you can find his commentary on this match too. And then after that, uh, now that we both have Extreme Gammon, uh, we're going to each review the match and then do a video together going through that. Double kill. That could be his first mistake already. I don't know, though. 3-1, obviously forced. Double twos. I don't think you just push up. Obviously come in with one. I guess you'd make the four point and play down. All right, that's, yeah, that's probably good too. Double sixes. There's that. And do we just bring it down to Omeletteville? I think we do. Because if he hits with the six, even if he rolls it, then he's not making that anchor. So, all right, so he did hit it. Potentially, he may make the bar. I doubt that. I very much doubt that he will make the bar. And let's see, we're up in the race. This looks bad. I guess we just do the. Actually, we want return shots on this. So let's do that. I don't know about that one. That one will be interesting. He just makes this. His 11. It's got to be. Does he hit? Is he really thinking about hitting? I have a lot of returns and a nice... Wow. Do I go for the return? I surely do. Okay. That's not a great roll for him, obviously. Uh, doesn't let him cover that. So, 3-1 is tough. I guess it's just three double cover, but... Like, yeah, I have time to make that. This play's fine. That might have been bad. We'll find out. It might have been make the five. Like, obviously, it's very important, typically, to be making your five point. But I feel like when he's already got a clean look at the, that, and we have uh, so many blots expl exposed, so that's not the best roll. Yeah, I can't count, just for the people who are at home wondering what took me so long. Uh, I was I miscounted that. That was a fine roll. <laughs> that was a totally fine roll. Make this. Double sixes again now would be well-timed. I think it's that. Just how much more flexibility could you ask for? I'd love that double six, get these guys around. Uh, I'm definitely not running yet, so let's just make the two. Let's not crumble. Let's get... Double twos would be good, too, here. That I think we do run with. We're still up a ton in the race. A six is critical. Uh, that's not ideal. A six. Oh my god, that's a joker for him. Oh, what a joker. I need to do six. Oh man, that's such the nuts. That's disgusting. Wow, doesn't go for it. I think that was probably a pretty big error. Make this point. Wow, it doesn't get punished, but now I can at least take the cube. Which 
which I would. Now he makes the bar. Okay. Wow, where he runs. Wow. Wow. Why can't I just like get a shot here? I'm really surprised by these moves. And now if Ian's doing it, it must be a pass. I was really surprised. Maybe that's why. It is maybe that's why that was the play. But man, I had some looks there to get right back into that, and I just fanned on both of them. So not much you can do. I mean, I, I'm tempted to double kill. I think I'm going to. Let's open this game up. I think that's right. I don't want to play three down is the reason why, and I don't want to play three in. And this just seems super weak, so I feel like that's fine. I'm going to have two guys protecting it. I can't hit him, but now we can do that. Now we're feeling all right. I should mention that I haven't played in a long time at this point. It's pretty... Yeah, we're up in the race. Let's just make it a race. 1-1's one, not a good shake for him. Now we have another look at this guy. I mean, I'd rather not even necessarily hit it, because I just have no home board. He has an advanced anchor. And I'm doing fine in the race, but, you know, certainly some numbers that I'll be hitting with. Man, I'm still stuck on that. The end of that last, I'm pretty surprised by. Okay. I'm. I bet this is not a hit, given that he has the advanced anchor. So with that in mind, I'm gonna play that, and maybe I'll find out that that was a huge error. But I really hate leaving two potential. I guess it would only be one, because I could play it to safety, but I just don't like opening this back up just yet. I feel like I really just need to roll doubles one more time, and then I'm in a pretty good situation. Do I want to strip the mid? I think I do. This is dramatic. I could use double sixes. Just play that to there. Kill some time. Roll double fives. Double fours. Yeah, double fours would be ideal. Double threes, double fives, double sixes would be the best. Okay, that's like a 3 out of 36 shot. That's a 1 out of 12 shot every single roll. Okay, so that's obviously not ideal. The right idea, I mean, it's either break that or leave a shot, and I'm not too interested in breaking that, so I think we do this. And now I'm regretting having this guy, because it's a huge weakness now. All right, at least he fanned. We're doing well in the race. It's very possible now that I should be cubing here. I don't think so. Get him to safety. No other way of doing it. Okay, now I'm potentially supposed to be cubing. If he plays these two down, which I'm suspecting he will. If he makes the ace, then I won't cube. If he plays these two down, then I probably will. So with that in mind, he should definitely... Be, yeah, okay, good good call by him. Because the cube flies if he doesn't do that. That 
would love to cover these. Like Ace Deuce would be a beautiful roll right here, if not big doubles. Who's three stuff? I, th I, th I thought for sure it was just safety. Okay, that's probably smart. No, I think I do have to break this, sadly. There's nothing else that's safe. It's just too strong. Level fives. Evens the race up. So that may actually be exactly what the doctor ordered for me to like bail out of a potentially dangerous situation and just make it a straight up race. Although the problem is Ian Terry is very fast. That is always, of course, the big issue. Uh, we will do that. Duh. I'm just going to crunch first. I'll take the double fives. Save that just in case. That might have been bad. We'll find out. Yeah, this might be why it might have been bad. Okay. So we're doing all right. Let's just keep them low. Keep them low. And now we'll think about this. 51 to 56, which is like a much cleaner bear off. Let's see how this goes. Okay, so just plays that one. We're slightly behind, but if we, I mean, we're ahead in the race, but we're behind on pulling off, so I need him to miss. Okay, now this is going to be a cube if he gets a five or a four. Okay. Now. This is going to be a cube. What's he do? I don't even know the move here. Yeah, okay. That seems logical enough. And that seems logical enough too. Now what's he do? Slot here and ace. Has to be. There's nothing. It's the only like legal move. I mean, like the only other six is there. I don't see that happening. A double kill. Let's go for that. So just slide them on up to Omelette Bill. What's it going to be, Dr. Terry? Is it that? Does it make the ace? Is it slot this? I think there are three plays that I could all see being justifiable. Yeah, I don't. I don't hate any of them. That one will be definitely one to look into. And now this one I think is. Let's let's take let's not rush this. Uh, I mean the five is covering. The other one's gonna kill. Fan twenty five percent shot at a fan. Suspense is killing me. Ah, not only is it not a fan, it's an anchor up. Oh, and there's the fan. Okay, cool. So I guess it is possible to, in fact, fan on a 3.0 board. But, uh...
No, I mean, his position definitely plays a lot uglier than mine, I would say, at this point. Even though they look pretty similar. Let's take him. What's, what's going on? Oh, was he thinking about a cube? Race is even. Position is essentially even. Like, I was just, I would, I would happily, I would snack, I would snag up the cube there. I would be rooting hard for a cube there. I think this is just a run. I think. <coughs> yeah. Nothing else to do there. And I don't feel like I have much else to do here other than play the safety. The race is dead even. I'm totally fine with my position. I'll take a 6-1. Or a 6-6 six, six, or a 5-5 five, five, or a 4-4. Four, 5-1, four. not quite. Is it this? Am I? I'm doing that. I don't even care what Extreme Gaming says. That's the play. That's the move. Duplicate the deuce. Yep, yeah, thank you. I'm a genius. No, I don't know about that, but I think that's probably pretty logical. I think there's... That's one to look into. I hope I remember to check that one during the review. It's probably not even that big of a deal if that is right. That was probably pretty obvious to anyone who's like good at this game legitimately. But for someone like me, I'm happy to find those moments and appreciate them when I can. All right. 6-4 for Ian. Not I mean, what do you do? Do you just put it there? Like, what more can you do? Play both? Both in there? Both in here, or just slot there? Yeah. And that is a nice, nicely timed 5-1. Oh, I could have explored. Ah, I should have thought about just cover with the one and play that 5, since he has these two blots, and now he's going to cover one of them. The deuce deuce is still kind of a killer for him. Okay. Not a killer, but a possible. Maybe in the future you might have maybe a little something to worry about roll. And I think we do that for lack of any better options, but I don't love it. Uh, and he can't love that. He's running out of time quickly. So I'm really hoping to roll a six here and cover this hog. Or I, or I will play it one to safety probably if. I get, ah, there aren't that many ones where I can just safety it. And then I'm looking for like six deuce. Six deuce or six one is what I'm looking for. <laughs> just get ready for him to run out of time. I mean, I don't know. Okay. Uh, so not only can I not hit, that's actually an extremely ugly roll. That's like the worst roll in the deck for me. So with that in mind, I'll play this. He still has some stuff to clean up. He, he, he's certainly not guaranteed any kind of... I, I could definitely still get another look here. Like, I was, I was literally about to say, what if he rolls 3-1? Like... I mean, the three is 100% in there, so where is the one? And now I've got a double look. And now now we might be reaching. Are we reaching? Do we reach? <sighs> like, it's not even that good, even if we do hit him, so let's not reach. But let's do hit. And let's see, four, okay, five, five. Okay, he has no, he has no hits. has no hits. And now do I reach? Alright, what the fuck? He's taking this so long. Sorry, gang. Oh! I wanted to think about reaching, but I didn't do it. Uh, let's see, well he still can't hit. Do I want to be on that 6 though? 
Let's do that, and he still has no hits. And now we definitely do think about reaching, now that it's going to probably be this and come in. But he's caught up, actually, at this point in the race. That's a big roll for him. The race is basically even. So now I actually, it's important that I don't roll Ace Deuce. Or something bad like that. He just plays them all to here. What are you doing, Ian? Just, just play them all to there. And now we can, if he like limps here, we can definitely, okay, that's not much of a limp. Now we can, okay, I keep jinxing it, and then now it looks like it might actually happen. That's two down. Oh, okay, that's, I guess, close. Like, if he limps once, I probably lose my market, is my rationale. But if I limp once, then maybe I should have thought that through a little more. I could. The other part is I could definitely see him passing, um, and I wasn't sure. Okay. Let's do that. I think that one is important. Okay, that one is also important. It means he's not getting very far. Oh, my God. Is there a better one to play in here? Is that a better one? It might be. Okay, it's pretty close. I could definitely, there are definitely timelines where I get re-cubed here pretty swiftly. Okay, that's a big roll, that's big time. Now I'm very, very happy about that cube, and now I'm even happier. Not, not super happy about that four coming off, but Feeling good. I definitely don't know if that was. I mean, this isn't great, but at least it's a miss. It's much better than 4 4. That's not great. Okay, let's not count these chickens yet. Let's not be counting them. Okay, that's huge. Let's get a big shake here. Big shake. That's not great. We need some sixes. No, oh my God, and I've lost. All right, that's fun. That's awesome. Fun times. It was probably a bad cube, but that's definitely not the not what I deserved. Is this, what is this? Is it that? I'm going with it, I'm tilted, I don't know. Jesus, all right. Let's maintain, let's not get frustrated, let's play good backgammon. You're being evaluated by a computer, the computer doesn't care how frustrating the losses are. Roll. Okay, we're fine. That's a good fan. Let's make a new point. Let's bring two down. Let's get the attack going. Come in on the one and two down. Or what? Couple ideas. Uh, I'm not gonna make the four. I'm just gonna do this. That does smack me. Well, I do have the turn looks with a six from here to here off the bar. 
And also a 4-4 four, four as a return look, as I flag that. <laughs> oh, brutal. I think it's just safety there. Uh-oh. Hit. Must be hit loose. And then make the two, I guess, actually. I hit loose. YOLO. Actually, it's probably make the two when I have the advanced tanker. That was a big time wall. Okay. And now does it fly? No. I need more points. Now it might fly. Defense. I think that's important. Block that six. Because, like, I still have... He still has a lot to worry about. I think this is an important point to make. Roll, please. I don't know why it's doing this. This is annoying. Okay, there we go. Oh, that seems good. I need to pause for a sec. <coughs> so apparently he hit me. I had to run to the bathroom. Shit. That's not ideal. You're also about to hear me eat a mozzarella stick, potentially. What does he do? I think it's got to be this five. He's got to make this point, in my suggestion. One of these days we'll hit the return shot. I really can't complain. I ran so hot during the entire calendar year of 2015 that I really can't complain about backgammon for at least another 10 months or so. This is tough because obviously he's not even remotely out of the woods. Here we go. That's a big roll. That's a big look. And now if he fans which he doesn't. He, in fact, makes the best possible point. Let's go for that. That was a big five escape. He's got to tread gently, because one misstep and I could easily find a cube here. 
But I mean, I guess that's kind of always the case in backgammon. That's a tough wall. I think it's probably just too up. As much as that sucks. Actually, no, it's got to be just six and then five here. That's what I play. Six, five. That might be short sighted. More than I think about it, but. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, I like that. Get inside of these landing spots. Yeah, he's probably right in saying that our performance ratings are going to be probably pretty bad this game because we are both not totally sure what to be doing. I might just, like, cube him to end it. <laughs> I don't think it would, though. I think he would take in a heartbeat. Although I do want to gammon him. Mozzarella stick number two. I think I just played it here. 24 to whatever. 13, uh, 15. Mm-hmm. That looks pretty good. Keep them high. Got a good look at a six prime here. And like here is exactly where I rolled all the sixes. Okay, close enough. So we have the six prime essentially locked. Just a matter of getting in safely. I guess we have A. He's got six back, and he's gonna crumble in here. We have some B G possibilities. Like he's he's toast. He's gonna crumble. So really hoping for four or for uh, two points here. That's bad because then six six is bad. No, it's not. Let's go with that. This is certainly roughly what dreams are made of. We prefer it if it was all stacked up on the one. But he's crumbling quickly. That's a good roll. All right, we're trying to avoid low fives and low sixes now. Oh no. And also that, oh no. Right, we have plenty of time to get around. There we go. And we're back around. 
So that was minor heart attack for no real reason. This is bad. Okay, that was good. You never like it when you uh, have only two guys against a double anchor on multiple points. A lot of forced rolls can be bad times for you. So a three is important here. Okay. Cool. Still pretty easily get back around though. So he just spaces that and two to there. Just play both from there. You want them on unique points for uh, definitely not right, in my opinion. Definitely want them on different points. Hold it. All right, there we go. That looks like the G. Got to keep that protect against 3-1 and ace-deuce and ace-ace and deuce-deuce and so forth. Okay. Should be pretty straightforward. All right, that should do it. No, I guess he's got life now. Bring those two in. He had life. 6-6 six, six would have done it. Alright, 3-3. Three to three. This is a long match. It's already been 37 minutes. It's only 3-3. Three to three. I'm going to kill. That's big. And that's big. That might have been an ambitious cube, but I thought he would pass. I still am fine with my spot. Off to a pretty hot start. Got my checkers where I want them for the most part. I kind of want them on there too, but they'll get there. The blitz is on. Damn it. Why can't he fan there? I don't think we swap. Oh, I didn't even notice that there was a, f a blot there that whole time, but that's okay. Here we go. That looks good. No three. Oh, man. That's not great. That's, that's bad. Let's go with that. Big fan. Ugh. We're still fine on this blitz. It's just annoying. This is annoying. Wow, that's a double kill. That is crazy. There's a kill. This is very frustrating. We were one roll away from a fucking gammon. But I guess that's what this game is all about. Must kill down here, I would imagine. Does he not see the kill? Okay, he sees it. All right. Let's 
Damn. Dreams of being up 7-3 quickly vanishing. I ended up playing that like kind of clown. Okay, that's the goddamn nuts. Makes this point and this point. Seems good. Now I have a very threatening home board, so he really can't leave me shots. Oh my god! This is so frustrating. <laughs> Let's spike the four at least. Does he even go for it? Like he's up enough in the race that he probably shouldn't even hit. That's probably the idea, is don't hit. It's gotta be the idea when he's up this far. 100%, right? There's no way he can hit. It's going to be up 26 pips when it's my turn to roll. You can just reship it. Yeah, definitely don't hit. Now I'm kind of screwed because I can't make it a race or else he's just going to send it right back. Not that I would want to, obviously, because I'm down this much, but... That double fives was just money in the bank. I'm going to keep that guy. Oh, no, I'm going to keep both of them. This I'm just playing with this kind of clownery over here. Give him some awkwardness. Yeah, that's awkward. No, he just placed it there. Now let's see him. 6-1. Ah! He doesn't hit. No way he hits. He's not that brave. He's not that foolish. He's more like it. I think this is a take. I think there's still... I'm really not sure about that take, but I think it's probably pretty close. Just because of how many awkward rolls there are for both of us going ahead. I might be wrong, but... Let's get a nice recube roll. Let's get a nice recube roll! He's definitely. Ooh, that's a nice double miss. Now we have some recubes. Not anymore. Damn. That's. Just 
I guess I guess I was the favorite because we both rolled the identical roll, so but that's still useful. All right, seven to three. I will be fully honest, and part of the reason that I took that is because this is just taking forever. But I also think it wasn't that bad of a take. We'll find out. But I don't think it's more than like a... I gotta say, I don't think it's more than like a 40 error, <laughs> which is still pretty bad. <laughs> no, it's probably... It wouldn't surprise me. I mean, it was nine pips, so... Not great. But it just felt like there were so many situations like that where I could re potentially, and that's a big... Whoops. Let's not mix-click that opportunity away. That was a big look. And now we are definitely in commanding position, obviously. And that's a big no hit. Just roll like a nice smooth looking seven here. Roll ace ace here. Would be nice. That's a pretty good looking roll too. And now we can probably be thinking about cubing pretty soon. But not with this match score, actually. Man, although it's getting warmer and warmer. <laughs> Three six is the shot. And now... Now we just play on for the G, hopefully. A lot of return shots here, needless to say, if he ends up killing. I don't that. Yeah. Yeah, this is... Oh, wow, okay. Okay. Nice response. Very nice response. Does he double anchor is the question. I think it's probably prudent to double anchor. I think that's my move. Just come in here. Give yourself a look. Yeah, I agree with that. Okay. that? No, it's not that. It's just all of them. Let's do that ace. Flexibility. We're playing on for a G. Let's see if we can do it to him again. <laughs> Some easier way of doing that. Let's look at that. Can't move. Bring him into safety. I really hope this just goes smoothly, but it all it just feels like it never does. It feels like it just never goes how I want it to go right here. Like why can't I just roll nothing but double sixes for the next couple rolls? I guess that would leave him a double shot after three turns, but let's keep the flexibility. We need him to crumple. Here we go, finally starting to get some checkers off. Need him to crumble. There he goes. A 
Wow, that's not ideal. No three or four? Okay. Now we're feeling good. And here's where I roll three, four, by the way, or like double threes. Okay. Let's get that G. G for the win. Oh my god, so exciting. It's so much drama. Okay. Just big dubs. Just big dubs. Just end it. Oh, he forfeits. Interesting. I'm not sure why he did that. Okay. I'll take it. We accept resignations. Um... So we'll do, Ian will have his own video up, and we will have, we'll do a review of this match and a separate video together. So that'll be cool. Uh, definitely be on the lookout for that. Thanks for watching.